We're introducing the newly reformulated Unblemish Regimen with a gentler, more effective cleanser, invisible SPF and even better results. We were motivated to reformulate Unblemish not just by science, but also from feedback from our customers. We accepted the challenge to top our own incredible solution. We always aim to deliver the best self-care experience for all our customers, so they look forward to using each step every day. So let's talk about what makes the new formulas even better. Not only did 97% of people have less acne, but study participants noted smoother, more radiant complexions with less frequent breakouts, and no white casts or greasy feeling on the skin. In our new step one, the Refining Acne Wash, we remove the exfoliating beads for a gentler yet effective clean. Customers will still get the exfoliation benefit with salicylic acid to clear pores, while colloidal sulfur helps balance oil production, which causes breakouts. The gentler, creamy cleanser will be a big hit as it removes oil, facial makeup, and impurities from the skin. Steps two and three are essential to battling acne and those early signs of aging with our multi-med therapy approach, which delivers ingredients in the right order for the best results. These steps have not changed, but are critical to getting those acne clearing results. Step two, the unblemished clarifying toner brightens and moisturizes the skin. Alpha hydroxy acids exfoliate while hyaluronic acid plus green tea extract calm and visibly firm skin. Step three, the dual intensive acne treatment clears and prevents breakouts with benzoyl peroxide or ceramides calm the visible redness and visibly plump skin. Step four is a new formula in the regimen. Invisible Matte Defense Weightless Moisturizer that protects with a 100% invisible finish on all skin tones. It features smart silica to keep you matte but never dry, and it's a really nice drive to the touch finish that will layer beautifully under makeup. We're proud to present the newly reformulated Unblemished Regimen.